Welcome to Tuesday's Tools on Purpose at the Business on Purpose podcast. Tuesdays are all about equipping you all with the tools that you need to run your business with intention and purpose. Our mission here at Business on Purpose is to liberate business owners from chaos so you can make time for what matters most. My name is Patrice Miles, and I'm one of the coaches on the team. And every Tuesday, you know I love to dive into a world of tools because in a world where your time is your most precious asset, finding those right tools can really help streamline your operations. So in each episode, I always bring you interviews with experts. We share success stories. We provide step-by-step guides. But remember, guys, as I always say, it's not about just having the right tools. You actually have to use them. So today's topic is Business at Pro, and I'm super excited to introduce you to Amy Torres. She's the founder and owner of Director of Marketing, and she also does all of the marketing for my nonprofit. So I am super excited. Amy, welcome to the podcast. Trace, thank you so much for having us, and we love working with you and your nonprofit as well. So Amy, tell us just a little bit about yourself. So I've been in marketing since 1998. I own multiple businesses, so I understand the pains of being a business owner, like having cash flow and making payroll. But I also look for tools that help business owners do their jobs better. We just tend to lean on the marketing side to do that. Yeah, that's fantastic. So tell me, what exactly is Business App Pro? So Business App Pro is one of our newest tools that we launched at the beginning of this year. And it is a tool to help busy business owners, especially those in the trade industries that are not sitting at a desk, but they're getting Google chats, Facebook Messenger, or Instagram messages that they don't want to lose those lead opportunities. So Business App Pro captures a lot of their website leads and their social media leads and puts them all in one inbox. It also allows them and their team to schedule their social marketing content, send out emails and text messages to follow up with possible leads and prospects as well. Oh, wow. This sounds fantastic. So how are you seeing businesses using this? We see them use it most often that the business owner will have a sign into the dashboard and to their business app pro, but they're usually assigning someone else on their team to kind of be in charge. What I love about this, if you guys know anything about software, many software companies charge by seat. Mm -hmm. We have a no seat fee, which I love because if you had a team of 25 people, all 25 people could have access and respond to leads or create the content and schedule their social marketing, or they can have one person in there. It just makes it easy. So business owners are using this. Typically they're signing in once or twice a day to look at their inbox and say, oh, I had a website lead come in. I had someone on Google chat. I had a Facebook message. And then from that inbox, they can respond to all of those messages without ever logging into Meta or without logging into Google. Yeah. Well, and then it sounds like too, the huge benefit is anyone in your team can do that. I don't have to have my owner's login or my husband's login or this person's Mm -hmm. login. Yes. You can get a unique login just for that person. And again, when you're out on a job site, you don't typically have access to your computer and answering messages on our phone through Meta is awful. Yeah, (laughs) And it's tied to our personal stuff. Sometimes I like to separate business from personal. So having inbox pro allows you to come up and separate some of those activities from your social accounts and just handle, have anyone on your team handle it for you. That's fantastic. So how many accounts can I have coming into this dashboard as far as lead sources? So right now we have a website lead source. So even if someone goes on your website, if they interact with our chat box, we can capture that data and we're asking them for their their email address and their phone number and their name and possibly their address, whatever you want to ask. And Messenger, it's just whatever they respond in Messenger that will pop in. And even if you guys have been getting a lot of spam, like most of us have on Messenger, you can immediately see that's a spam message and just delete and not have to worry about it. But you just log into Business App Pro Your inbox looks just like a normal inbox, but it's shown you this one come from Instagram, this one come from Google chat, and this one came from your website. So you know where the lead source come from. Okay. Okay. And so it sounds like not only is it a great house for leads, responding to leads, follow up from all these different sources, but if I don't have an amazing marketing firm like yours to help me do my social media, it's also going to be a scheduler for me to be able to put posts and schedule all those things out. Yes. We love it. So the social marketing tool that's inside Inbox Pro, we've actually been using since March of 2020. So they've essentially built this program around that. You can literally schedule out a year in advance. Not that any of us would do that. I don't think most of us could come up with enough. (laughs) However, inside that tool, you can connect your Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, Google business listing, TikTok, and Twitter, now X. 
schedule content on all of those platforms or just the ones you want to schedule on. And there's an AI tool in it too. So if you can't think oh. of what to write, you can use the AI prompt and put in your idea and then you can like have it write it for you. And then you can like, okay, I need to revise that or redo that. So even if you get writer's block for your business as business owners, it's so hard to write for our own company. Yeah. It's easy to talk about someone else's awesome company, but it's harder for us. But this is a great tool. So if even if you have a niece or nephew or someone helping with social, everyone likes to use that young person that's affordable they can use this tool and have that scheduled and it's transparency. Anybody in your team can see that social content. It'll even go one step further, Patrice. Campaign Pro in there will allow you to also draft and send email messages to those people that come in through your uh, website and Facebook leads. Oh, fantastic. Can I schedule those emails too? Or is it can, instant? Yes. Oh you can schedule goodness. and send that stuff out through Campaigns Pro and then even SMS messaging. The trades folks find the SMS a little bit easier, especially if they're confirming appointments or leads. Like if they had someone call in and they want a quote, you can remind that homeowner too that they have a quote coming up in an in-person meeting. Okay. Okay. This all sounds fantastic. And it also sounds like it puts you a little bit of out of a job, Amy. I mean, if I can do everything in the dashboard, but I know as far as my nonprofit, I don't have time to go in there and generate that content. And that's what I find amazing that you guys also offer those services. But for those do-it-yourselfers, this business app sounds amazing. So what's the best way for them to get a hold of you or contact you in regards to getting this new tool? They are welcome to email me at amy, A-M-Y, at directorofmarketinginc.com or text me at 502-727-0961. And if they just put business app in there, I'll know what they're talking about. And we set up a free consultation. Yeah, that's fantastic. Well, Amy, is there anything else our business owners need to know or did we cover everything? You know, inside Business App Pro, it's important to capture that lead data. There's also a built-in generic CRM system, which is customer relationship management. But we always tell business owners, keep your data, back up your data. Do not rely on a third party to have your customer data. But this is a tool to help you capture some of that data and maybe increase the amount of people in your funnel. Okay, so wait a minute. So now I've got a CRM, I've got a social media post scheduler, and then I also have lead capture and follow-up all yep. in this tool. Why all in one tool. And okay. it's meant to be streamlined. And one more thing I love about it, no matter your age, you can use it. And we also train you, but we have folks in their seventies using our tools, which makes my heart happy because technology does not have to be a barrier just based on age or based on how busy you are. We try to make it super easy. Yeah, well, you guys do. So thanks for everything that you do for Care Africa. Amy, thanks so much for showing up today and sharing this with us. Thank you so much, Patrice. I appreciate it. Well, guys, that is a wrap for Tuesday's Tools on Purpose. Enjoy your new tool, Business App Pro. But remember, every small action can lead to big results. So what action are you going to take today in regards to Business App Pro? One thing I can think of is get a hold of Amy. Find out more about this new tool. For those of you all that are tired of living in chaos and you're ready to actually start working on your business instead of in it, I would love to show you how you can finally start seeing some return on investment in your areas of time, money, and a business that can actually run without you. So if that's something that you've been wanting for a long time, but you just don't know the path to get there, schedule a discovery call with me so I can learn more about your business. You can email me at patrice at mybusinessonpurpose.com. Patrice is Pat Rice at mybusinessonpurpose.com. Um, if you're on our YouTube channel, Kevin's going to put up a QR code and also that email address. And then last but not least, guys, you know, I always offer our healthy business owner assessment. If you're actually brave enough to take it, you can find out how healthy your business is. And that is at bit.ly forward slash healthy business one. Again, that's bit.ly L-Y forward slash healthy business one. Guys, I'll tell you a zero is not a good score, but a 40 is perfect. So if you're brave enough, go find out how healthy your business is. Otherwise, guys, I'll see you next Tuesday. Thanks so much.